My favorite thing is doing rallies. <laughs> When we when we had a kid, you know, then your risk level well, your risk level increases, but like your, the the emotional feeling of that risk is way heightened. I live in, in Oakland, California. I live right on Telegraph Avenue. It's like a really important thoroughfare for all different modes of transit. There's the bus line that goes up and down. People drive up and down it. People ride their bikes and walk up and down it. It can be pretty busy. We weren't taking it as one of the main ways to get to work or wherever we were going. For a while, we didn't feel safe kind of crossing the street because people were flying down. You know, it's scary having to deal with that every day. And before, we would have avoided Telegraph at all costs. One of the reasons Bike East Bay focused on Telegraph Avenue for advocacy was it was really a street that wasn't working for very many people. The distance be between traffic lights is huge, and so that's where cars speed. And so if you look at the high injury network in Oakland, where most of the crashes happen, it's very easy to see where Telegraph is on the map. The big change is instead of a wide four-lane road uh, with no bike lane, there's now a bike lane which is protected by not only a buffer and these big cones, but also by parking. Previously, when you were biking on Telegraph, the cars were whizzing by on the left-hand side. So instead, now you're biking on a bike lane which is next to the curb. On your left-hand side, there's parking. So it feels really comfortable, safe and comfortable to, to bike without having traffic going by all the time. We also have a ton of green paint to make it higher visibility, as making sure that drivers know that this lane is for bikes. It's really been transformed into a place which is a lot more welcoming. Before uh, this, I don't think we had ever brought our daughter on Telegraph. Having a group or a force like Bike East Bay, you know, they've been working on this project for many, many years. Um, they're working with the local government. They're our voice. A bike-friendly East Bay works for everyone. What we've seen with changes like you see on Telegraph where we go from a really car-centric street to a more people-centric street is it becomes more safe and more welcoming for everybody. Cars aren't going as fast, it's safer to cross the street, it's friendlier to, to ride, it's friendlier for people walking. Telegraph Avenue is part of a larger vision for what the East Bay could look like for, for biking and sustainable transportation.